Hello everybody and welcome back to Gaming Sanctity. Today I'm bringing you another character creation video here in Head Start on Black Desert Online. Um, last time you saw me make my main, um, which may remain my main or may not, um, Balrock here, uh, the wizard. Um, you can definitely go check out that video if you haven't already seen it. Um, but we are going to go ahead and create another one right here. Um, so this one... Um, there are two other ones that I want to create, and that would be the Warrior and the Berserker here. So, um, I want to say we're going to go ahead and maybe... See, you can look at the different uh, play styles. Very defensive, very combo uh, heavy, very strong attack and defense, um, which appeals to me. Um, so we are gonna go ahead and just do the warrior for this one and uh, next video we'll try to get to the berserker. So you have the different horoscopes. Not gonna spend too much time on these. Uh, if you want to check out my last video it has all of them. I go through every single one of them um, and you guys can check that. And of course, being the warrior, um, I should probably choose the shield. Um, so I think we're going to go with uh, that one for our horoscope. And we'll just jump right in here with different hairstyles. All different kinds. Mohawk. Nice. This one is very uh, noble-like, I think. And we could just go bald, but um, I'm going to choose one hairstyle. Don't know which one, though. Um, it'd be nice if he would not turn his face. There we go. And we just have a whole bunch of different ones here. I'm liking either this one or... Maybe this one. But I feel like everybody goes with uh, this kind of hairstyle for them. So we may go with uh, this one for, for the no more noble look. We'll go on in here and you can change the length and everything. As you can see here. Probably move that back, yeah. We can change the length there. And link three, which would be the, the very back there. Keep that one kind of longer. And I think that's good. Got the color here. Go through. I do like uh, white hair, but it's, it's just so weird in this game uh, seeing them in white hair it with how they have the hair effects and everything it's it's kind of strange um at least in my opinion or in any hair to be honest it's a little odd looking at it so you can change to any color you'd like it could be super green um let's see here if you quit turning your face we don't want to see you not right now. So we may keep that. Um, that or a lighter gold. I, it's just so hard to tell how it's going to look compared to the other ones. But going back through here, um, I'm thinking I'm wanting to change my hair to like this style. So we have the hair ends here, and um, we can dye that all black, which would be nice. Or we can get a, a nice white tint uh, to it um, to have that kind of like silverish kind of hair. And then we may, well, we may want to uh, change the length a little bit down. So 
see where this one is. Oh, that's our sideburns. Okay, we'll keep those long. Ooh. Oh, and hearts the eyes. Don't know what goes with that. Curl? Oh, yeah, curl hair. Well, wow, that's, uh, that's crazy. <laughs> so, we're going to stick with that one, I think, and go on to the next part. Which, if you go back up here, we will start the, the main part of the face. And you can have different uh, starting ones here. Rugged old man, yeah. Kind of like that one. It's kind of rugged, like he's he's been in the battle. He's seen some stuff. It's not bad. And of course, you can fully customize any of it. Um, and then you can change uh, skin type if you'd like. All different kinds here. Very odd ones you can you can change too. I don't know which one we want to stick with here. Those eyebrows are really uh, freaking me out. I'll have to change that pretty quickly. Go more pale. Yeah, I think we'll stick with that one right there. So we have facial hair. A whole bunch of different stuff we can do for facial hair. Um, and this will be density. So we'll turn that up so we can actually see. This is basically like a under shadow kind of, uh, or a five o'clock shadow kind of thing we got going on here. Um, so we'll try to see what we want to to keep. I think I like that one. And we'll keep it to, to where it is. Maybe maybe a darker beard. You know, to actually match our our hair color here. And then we'll go in. This is the actual beard. So you can change that up. Change it to little bit on the lighter side but not too much um, you know just different beard types um, if you want to get that that'd make us look kinda scruffy maybe we can reduce that uh, it's not it's not bad but it's not good either See what they look like on just length. I'll have no no curl and just straight beard. But I think we're going to go with this uh, kind of like more five o'clock shadow for this one. And you can have a mustache. A whole bunch of different kinds. That one may be kind of cool if you're going for that look. But I am not. So we're going to go on to sideburns. I think we're going to need some sideburns though. Every epic person has some epic sideburns. These are pretty good. I have to reduce that length of hair though. I wish they were a little more we don't want to see your face. A little more cut. No, that one's not that great. That one's pretty good. But I don't know if it goes in well with our uh Or beard because it is kind of straggly as you can see right on the edges wish you could trim that up 
a bit. That would be uh that'd be nice. Like you could just uh shape it. That'd be kinda cool. Uh, I don't think that's a bad though. And you have your default brow. If we can go in here just a little bit up here. Let's be behind your eyebrow, you know, this little part right here as you can see. And then if you actually go into your eyebrows. Of course we're going to change the color here a little bit. Um, it's not terrible. Let's see if we like any of the other ones a little more. That one kind of looks a little more badass with the hair, I think. So we're going to stick with that one. And now we're on to the face, where we can customize any and everything uh, just as you will see. So we can bring his jaw out um, even more, make his cheeks go in. all the different little parts here. Try to give them a, a strong jawline um, look kind of cool. You know since he's uh, he's rugged he's been out, he's seen some stuff, he's been in battle. Um, one of these I think it's this one? The horizontal is, yes, the bridge of the nose. You can see you can do just a insane amount of customization if you're wanting to. Um, but we're gonna try try to get them down the way at least I want them to look um, for my character here. The, the most. We'll see see just how, how well it turns out. Um, I, in Black Desert Online you can uh, customize but you are locked to kind of uh, genders on certain classes. So um, it does have a, a good customization tool but you are limited to kind of look like one type. So like I'm uh, on the warrior you're limited to be a human and a human that's roughly around 20 years old. Um, same with the ranger, a female, around 20 years old, um, for all that. So we're going to go look through here. And I'm liking, I'm liking how it's looking right now. Because I, I like the default a lot um, on almost all of them. Um, but I like to make my own little changes in between here. So we have that there. Now we can go on to uh, eye makeup if you'd like to do that. Um, I do not. I go over it. Uh, you can do, you know, the amount and then the area. You know, you can be really evil if you'd like. All that jazz. Um, a lot of people do face paint. Lots of different things you can do uh, with face paint as you can see here. You know, just change a whole bunch of stuff. Uh, which that one's kind of cool, uh, not going to lie. I'm like majestic moonlight, and I shine. <laughs> but um, I don't know if we will be, we'll be doing uh, eye makeup. I'm not a fan, at least on my character. Unless I was playing some kind of like uh, demonic warlock kind of class. And then you have the different lip types we're not going to go through because um, I think the default here is really good. Go on to eyes, and if we zoom in here, you can see this is a pupil, and as it's changing, uh, what's going on 
with all of that. I kind of like that one, I think. The default one's not bad either. Um, maybe the default a little more. Kind of like that one. Then you can get your iris. You can see you can change it on how it looks. That one's not bad. You can change the, the backdrop of it as well. Just to have a, a mix and match of uh, different colors if you'd like. Some really cool blues you can throw in there. I kind of like that. Um, well, pupil, we may want to change... I guess we'll keep that and then we'll come back. You can change different eyes as well. Uh, each one, you know, just check if you want to change one eye to a certain layout. Stuff like that. You guys can do that. And we can look at all these uh, these different ones here. That one's kind of cool. Kind of like we've uh, we've been in a battle. <laughs> kind of have some some dirt in our eye kind of thing um, which is kind of cool with the effect of it maybe we can get a little bit deeper or a brighter blue coming out of our eyes here and you would think to get that with the pupil but it doesn't appear to be working very well with some of these colors But lots of customization, as you can see. So much you can do. And that that is kind of cool. I, I like that, how it's set up right now. Kind of a, a darker eye, but also uh, lighter whenever you're looking at it. pretty good. We're going to go on to the eye line. Um, you know, your eyelashes, which will be right under there. Um, if you can see them even, we'll have to go length. Um, you can see them right there up here. But we're a man and we don't, we just cut all of our eyelashes off. We don't, we don't even blink. We don't get dirt in our eyes. Never. So I think I'm going to stick with that. And you can do uh, eyeliner, you know, anything like that. If you'd like, you know, you can increase the amount. Tons of stuff you can do if you're really looking in to uh, customize, customi sorry about that, customization on the eyes and stuff like that. Um, just a ton of different stuff you can do. But we are going to have nothing. And then the bottom of the eye, of course, um, you know, the little, because uh, that other one is the top and this is just the bottom. So, you know, you can mix and match with those if you'd like. And then we'll go on to tattoos. And these are face tattoos that you can do. <laughs> Even the little ghost there. You can be a really creepy really creepy um, in so many ways. That's kind of cool. I like that for a warrior kind of noble. We will probably reduce its size um, on both ends and then make its Y go up if we're going to have it on our head here. And just see if we can get it to a, a 
decent look. Um, if we're going to have it, not a fan too much of face tattoos as well. But uh, I like this one. But we may want to not have it because it, it kind of messes with our, our image a little, a little too much. You can even be a cheetah. So many different ones, and you can do almost anything. You know, you can put it right here, you can invert it, um, have all the different things. You can change uh, and rotate it even if you want it like a certain way and then you can position it like under your eyes or stuff like that on your cheeks um, this is where you would do that um, a whole bunch of different stuff but we're gonna keep just that plain one then we go on to our standby expression this one is, you can change um, you know as you can see it will be shown in game standby motion oh, sorry about that huh, getting getting a bit tired it's been a long day but as you can see here, we can do that one and have some really creepy uh, smile with our teeth. Stuff like that. Um, you can just change almost anything. Be real err. And the teeth are just hilarious. And it's all a little sad. Stuff. <laughs> it's just funny. And then, what? <laughs> what happened? <laughs> oh my god. What is going on? Oh no. <laughs> It's just uh it's just too funny to see. But I think we will we'll stick with that default one. Um but you can, you know, change that around if you'd like. So we'll go ahead and get out of that. Then we move on to the body. And this is where you can make yourself as ripped as possible or whatever you would like to be. Um we have pretty good setup. We're gonna want our, our butt maxed out we gotta have those that max but we just we just have to we can't not have a magical butt so we may increase slightly our torso or not our torso the uh, the shoulders there and maybe the torso just a tad bring this in a little and then yeah, maybe bring that in a little. You can see what it looks like as you're you're going through here. We are fairly ripped. Um, once we get to muscles, you can really show how ripped you truly are. Um, but you can do just tons of different stuff. Even your your little hands right here, you can adjust how your hands look um, for when you're holding certain weapons and things like that. So we're gonna go ahead and go into muscles. And part one would be your chest. You can be super ripped out. Um, we're going to tone it back a bit. We're going to be ripped, of course. But we're not going to be ungodly. Um, and then again with the arms, you can see the amount you can get there. And we're going to tone that back again to about the same. And then uh, the third would be your legs. Of course, whenever you get really ripped on your legs, you kind of look like you've been in the sun a little bit too long. Um, so we're going to turn that back maybe to about the same. Yeah, I'd say that's a pretty good overall. Um, pretty pretty ripped out. Got to get our, our butt looking good. We may go to the shape and see how we're going to adjust that to see if we can get ourselves looking good in some some shorts or something you know that's how we that's how we roll got to look good for the later ladies here in uh black desert online um well although most of the ladies um in this game are probably just males playing lady characters and stuff like that so we have all of that. I think we're pretty good on that. And then you have body tattoos. 
So now we go into our body tattoos. And that one looks really good. That one's a pretty detailed one. It's kind of cool. Lots of different stuff you can do here. You can see all different kinds of uh, tattoos. But I think that one is actually really good. And I kind of like the placement right on the, the arm right there. So we're going to keep that one. And then you can edit your pose. Now you can do this in any way. You can save it. You know, just move your arms, your fingers, everything. And you can have a custom pose. Um, but I will not be doing that. But you can do so much stuff. Same right here. You know, edit whatever you would like it to look. Remember, this is how it will pose, essentially, with weapons as well. So, you know, don't be uh, putting, uh, you know, like a salute um, so much. Because uh, I think if you salute like that, it would basically, if you had a sword, it would stab it through your head kind of animation. So, you know, just notice that whenever you're you're making your own little poses there. So we have all that, and now we can look at the voice. And I can't hear it. What? Hold on. We're having some sound. That one's not bad. Sounds kind of like an older older person. Been in uh, battle a little bit. Um, you can even change uh, position, you know, how you look. Bunch of different ones for these as well. You can go through. <laughs> On almost all of them. It's pretty insane. our battle pose. Yeah. Oh, this will be number one. And then here's number three. But everybody can change that around as they like. Um, well, we are going to just stick to this one. So we have that going on, like in the face, everything, um, what we've done, and then you can change around the clothes if you'd like, so we'll zoom out so we can see a little more here. Then this P uh, for premium, which means I, be, I believe you can only buy it through the, the cash shop, um, these uh, little costumes here, which this is the... Uh, the uh, Conqueror's costume for it, and then you'd have a helmet on it, of course, with all that. And then uh, I am the Explorer's package, so I should get these two, but I got it for uh, the, the Wizard, so we'll have it for the Wizard. But you can see all the different kinds on how you will look throughout various stages as you're leveling up. And I I kind of like that. I think that one is good to go. Um, I like overall how it's going. I may even like it more than my uh, main. Don't know if I'll be playing it as much, but we will see how it goes. Um, because I do have I have reserved <laughs> quite a few things for the the wizard there, um, with all that different stuff through the packages so we will we will see or I mean I'm sure there's a a change of anything but uh, I kinda like this youthful um, warrior that you can be um, so let's let's see what we can go on some clothes real fast again um, just to see how it's gonna look overall It's not bad. 
I think uh, that's that's pretty good. Not bad at all. We will go ahead and get that name. Well, if I don't put caps in anything, that'd be great. And Zalthane, which is uh, a name I've used since World of Warcraft 4, uh, kind of uh, warrior type noble classes. And we'll go ahead and complete the character. And there we have it. We were able to get that name too, which is nice. Um, so there he is. There's that finished product. He is majestic, and he is a warrior. Um, so that's it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. If you'd like to see more Blade and Soul uh, content, I show that on my channel as well. And I will definitely be bringing a lot more uh, Black Desert Online content because I'm, I'm really enjoying this. I, I enjoyed Arcage a lot until, you know, a lot of what on, went on with that and how it became pay to win. But I enjoy sandbox MMOs. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, you know, leave a comment down below on maybe more videos you'd like to see, um, especially with the different professions here in Black Desert Online. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace.